officers are always ready to um, take action uh, on whatever that they need to. Senate Bill 4, which took effect Monday afternoon, then was swiftly blocked by the United States Supreme Court, would have given Texas law enforcement the authority to arrest undocumented migrants. Experts say it's a law that's unprecedented. They could be picked up by local law enforcement, be detained, uh, arrested, prosecuted, and then possibly taken to the border and asked to return. The Austin Police Department says SB4 preparations are already underway, though arresting those who aren't undocumented isn't a major concern for officers in the capital city. I could see there being a... Uh, uh additional arrest warrants. Lieutenant Fausto Rodriguez with APD says because Austin isn't a border city, he doesn't anticipate an increased workload if SB4 were to take effect. Officers are already well-trained, uh, well-versed on immigration policies. Definitely in, in El Paso and some border towns, it's, it's going to be a little bit different than what we're dealing with just because of the proximity to the border. Laredo being one of those border towns. In an interview with CBS Mornings, Webb County Sheriff Martin Cuellar says SB4 would strain their agencies. It's a burden to everybody, you know, I'm talking to law enforcement in general because we're not immigration officers, we're first responders. And regardless of state geography, public defenders are anticipating that same strain should SB4 take effect. In a statement to CBS Austin, public defender Timothy Shepard says it would certainly impact the roles and caseloads of state and federal prosecutors and public defenders. He adds prosecuting and defending those cases is a significant undertaking, whether in state or federal court. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.